what's up youtube i am back with another video today and today i will be doing a video a part three to me not showering with soap i don't yeah me not showering with soap because i made another video on tiktok about me not showering with soap sharing it with people to try to open people's mind up and everybody's going crazy so i was like let me do another part three to it because people still got questions so if you're new to my channel a lot of crazy things going on go down over here you know what i'm saying i talk about everything you know what i'm saying a little bit this little bit that so yeah but if you <laughs> I already know what's up on my channel y'all already know what's up welcome back um and if you want to subscribe go ahead hit the subscribe button while you're here why not and go ahead and thumbs up because you're gonna like this video anyway so i get this these main two questions i've been getting lately is what do i do when my period is on and what if you work out every day okay i don't work out every day well, I, I work. I just started back working. I used to work out, but then I took a, the whole month or two off. But I'm back on track now, and so you definitely sweat. That's normal. And on my period, a lot of people like what are you, people are. I want to talk about the period first. So I just need to know what is the issue with your period. You should not be panicking about your period. It's just blood. It's natural. It is okay. And I definitely, for my period, I use, if you want to know, a lot of people ask what I use. I use a menstrual cup and I use reusable pad. And I have videos on that also. I will leave those in the description. But do not panic. If you're trying to start this no soap journey, it's not the end of the world. Just try it one day. Just try it and see if you like it. Matter of fact, I say give it three days and just see. How you like it because when i'm on my period it is not that serious i clean myself the same you know what i'm saying i i screw up every time i get in the shower i don't half do my showers you know what i'm saying i don't half do it because oh this no i scrub the ground you know <laughs> literally i'm just saying i, I screw up everything I'm, I'm and i'm gonna show you i'm gonna see if i can stand up by the end of this video and show y'all how to how and demonstrate how I um shower with no soap, how to do it because <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, you just stay clean, just clean yourself properly. It is not nasty. I know it is far fetched because we've been getting products shoved down our throat in our entire lives. So when someone tells you that they're not using no products for their body, people are like, huh? What do you mean? I mean, y'all acting like I'm trying to tell y'all to go dirt bathed with dirt bathed with sand bathed with powder i'm just telling you to try it that is it that is all just try it if it don't work for you that is fine i'm just saying i just i mean unless you got a medical issue then it may not work for you i don't know but i'm just saying we're humans we kind of are similar but your girl skin be on fleek and people ask me do i put lotion on when i got the shower no i don't I don't put, I put oil on me and there's only two places I put, I got my own oil. There's only two places that I put oil on me and that is my face and my feet. Depending on what I'm doing, what type of day it is, because I will, I don't, look, let me show you what I'm talking about. Like, you see right now, I'm not ashy, but look, if I do that and do that, then I'd be ashy. But, um... So if I'm, you know what I'm saying, being extra for the day or whatever, I might oil my legs up and stuff like that. But other than that, I probably put oil on my legs. I would say probably 30 times out the whole entire year. Out the whole entire year, 365 days. Because when I used to shower with soap, my skin used to be super duper dry when I got the shower. It's my ashy everywhere. I mean, everybody might not have a problem because some people do put moisture, I think, moisturizer in their soap. But yeah, you gotta realize we got natural oils in our skin. And we think we be here. We think we be helping our skin by putting uh this dove, this this product, this that product. We think we be helping our skin, but we really hurting our skin. You know what I'm saying? With the natural oils that we got in there. And y'all really think I'm just gonna be about to be walking around with a stank, a stank, like what? And then y'all be like, girl, if I go a whole day, if I go a day without, so I'm gonna be stanking. I have to take a shower. Some probably, some people say they have to take a shower twice a day. And I'm like, I'm not judging you, but I'm like, dang, what are you, what, what's going on with your body? You got to bathe twice a day. I bathe once a day. I'm going to keep real with you. Sometimes I skip a day. It 
days I don't work out. Now, days I work out, I definitely have to take a shower. But, like, if I take, okay, so my last, I work out Monday through Friday. I know this video all over the place. But, listen, I work out Monday through Friday. I just started back, so don't judge me. So, on Friday, when I get finished working, I take a shower. So, Saturday, I might get up and go run some errands without taking a shower. That's what I mean by missing the day. You know what I'm saying? Like, my body's not going to stink that fast. You you know what I'm saying? Like, I got to be doing some real, and even if I do, I'm, I know y'all going to think I'm tripping. But listen, I used to be so musty down there. Like around the lip area, I used to get musty around there. I don't. The only place I would say that it gets like a musky type of um sweaty type of smell is probably most is my butt crack if I'm working out a whole, whole lot. Like, say like today, I ain't, I've, I've, I've been out running errands, but there's no, because I ain't really, I've just been in the car. Walking around and all that stuff, but if it was, and it is kind of cold, cool today. But if it's a hundred and some degrees and I'm outside doing this and doing that, sitting outside in the sun, you know what I'm saying, just walking around, dancing, and all that stuff, then okay, it might be a little sweaty back there. I might get a little sweat right there, but I make my own natural deodorant. So my nat and I have natural, natural, natural products that I use and I make myself that I put there. When I know I'm gonna be moving around, and I have something else that I put in other places too, I got a um personal hygiene video already on my channel. So if you wanna watch that, I'll leave that link in the description to show y'all different natural remedies for personal hygiene. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, don't be panicking on your period, child. Just try it out one day, and y'all can't be relying on soap to clean y'all body. One hundred percent is all I'm saying. You gotta have to screw up. You gonna have to work. You can't go in the shower and sit in there for one or two minutes <laughs> and think you just did something because you smelled. No, you gonna have to work, baby. You are gonna have to work for it. So, if you really wanna um, so what else? The period and work out. Yeah, work out. I just told you. Watch shower every day. Like, I mean, sometimes when I work out, maybe I may have to scrub a little bit harder because of the sweat. But other than that. It's just the period and the working out is just like you know, I, I always strive to just be clean when I get the shower and that's what I aim for and that's what I get like well don't worry I was the same way I frowned up at people too when uh, at a few people when they were saying they didn't shower with soap and they ain't use soap in the whole yeah I was like I know you nasty but hey that's what happens when you you got to open your mind try new things because you never know my skin i be seeing people put so many products on their skin this cream that cream that's that all this that this that i mean i put my natural oil on my skin but i don't have to you know what i'm saying if i want the extra mm, i would have to be like yeah i'm gonna put some oil on my skin but it i we really don't need it but i like it you know what i'm saying but I don't put no extra cream. No, I don't use no extra face soap. This, that. People be spending two, three hundred dollars on their skin. Well, I'll tell you, it's all about what you put inside your body. You feel me? Drink water and put stuff inside your body. Now, if I ate oily foods all day, every day, you definitely gonna see it on my face. Like pimple here, pimple here, bump there, bump there. Like yeah, I my skin will talk to me. But just try it out. I'm telling y'all, y'all will just see improvement on your skin improvement down there i just be so surprised i'd be like what i just be surprised I'm like i'd be surprised every time i just be like dang this is all day and there's still nothing i when i smell soap it reminds me of when i had off balance stanky box i hate the smell of soap Oof. I don't like it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if y'all got some more questions about this because y'all still going in about the notes. So y'all open your mind. And then it's one. I had this one person call me something. I literally, she was, she didn't really like what I was saying about the um no soap. I literally went to their page. They literally are promoting just straight feminine hygiene products. I'm telling you, if you have to put feminine hygiene products on your body every day, all day for your, you are doing something wrong. You need to evaluate. 
put those products down and work on your educate yourself about your diet because a lot of y'all have never had a healthy meal ever even when y'all think y'all eating healthy you're not eating healthy like some people be making a whole salad but they put bacon eggs cheese chicken tenders ranch dressing bacon beans and all that stuff on there and i'm like bro that's not healthy and people be cooking um vegetables like cooking kale and vegetables but they be putting um pig meat in the, in the greens and oil i'm like it's no longer healthy anymore so yeah try to eat y'all some fresh fruits fresh vegetables water and stay away from a lot of processed food because i'm not gonna lie i do i indulge in the little vegan processed food every now and again but <laughs> not every day all day like how everybody be doing a lot like i used to do i'm not gonna lie i used to eat all day every day but i've educated myself i make sure i have me some fresh fruit juice for breakfast you know what i'm saying make sure i drink my water i thought i had water right there but i don't make sure i drink my water and um what else yeah just try to do better but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you have any other questions and thanks for watching don't forget to thumbs up leave a comment thumbs down if you don't like the video thumbs up if you did i don't care do one of them and thanks for watching Bye-bye.